Hello, I am back with my another tutorial. But before starting, I would like to wish you a very happy Christmas and a happy new year. The winter is here and so on the holidays. So I thought, why not create something related to winter? So in this tutorial, I will show you how you can transform your green landscape to a snowy winter and a snowfall. So without further ado, let's just jump into it. This will be our base layer to start with. I have already taken out the green area out of this image and named as a green. Next step, I will create a new layer. I will name it as a snow right. I will choose a brush. Make sure your foreground color is white and start painting it. Don't worry about the white which is you know going all over places because we will just cover it with layer mask using control and arrow like this. So this will be visible only in this area. You don't need to be too precise in this. Something like this will work. We can always refine because it is on the separate layer. Once you reach at this level, we have to go to the blending mode for this particular layer. So how you can do that? You can simply double click right side of this layer and you will jump into the blending mode for this particular snow right layer. What we have to do is we don't need to touch any of this simply just go to the underlying layer. So how this works is this is your black point. This is your white point and it will work for this particular layer. So if you move like this, it will hide all the shadow area for this particular layer which is underlying of this layer so we have to reach something like this okay but the point problem is that you know slider is uh, very harsh and it is if you see if you zoom out you can see that it's very hard and so what we can do now is to smoothen it we will break this point you can see that there is a white line it shows that you can break this so how you can do that just hold your alt button in your keyboard and with mouse just drag like this as you can see now it's smoothening it's not that hard so we have to do it something like this let me just zoom out for you so this completely blows my mind when I see this first time as you can see that all the highlights area not the shadow part is covered with the snow because of this white layer. So I will just adjust depending on the taste. So I hope you can see this. So I will just adjust these layer. You can see that I am increasing the snow. I am decreasing the snow and the green area is visible. I would like to keep it something like this where the very little shadow is visible and most of the white part is visible because I want to make it look like a snow. Let's just press the OK. As you can see that this completely blows my mind when I did it for first time. So you can see that our right part is already looking like it's a snow. I will paint further to give the snow look where the area is still empty. Let's do it for water also because you know we can show it like it's a icy water. 
something like this will work okay uh, let me just drop down opacity a little bit because I don't want to do it for 100% for all the things okay similarly let's just do it for half part you can do it for once also but that did, does not you know work for me and it was not giving the good result so i would like to do half half way because this particular uh, setting what i have done here was not working for throughout the image so that's why i have divided into left into right so something similar i will do here also i would like to create one more layer let's say left and then i will again go back to the 100 percent and i will paint like this for my right portion don't worry you don't need to be too precise you can always delete as this is in a separate layer i would like to paint especially the green part first because there i want to see that how my eyes will look okay something like this then we need to repeat the step what we need to do is again get into the blending mode for the snow left and shift this okay something like this once you reach a particular shadow when you are able to see it simply break this using alt button and drag like this until you see something similar to this you can adjust your shadow to increase or decrease the snow i would go with something like this hit ok then i would like to further paint to give the eyes look to the other areas let me try with ok wait uh, let me just undo few step uh, let me just decrease the opacity for the water part and smoothly painting it on top of my water so it give you the feeling of a snow sorry I painted on the wrong side that's why I'm telling you that you know this particular setting does not work for both the side so what else we can you know enhance this let me just bring i have already selected one person photo i have already masked it let me just take this person to my painter composition just drop this so this is uh, why it is showing like this is because this is also showing as a layered mask so just remove the layered mask apply the layer mask for this particular layer so you can you know rescale it something something like this uh, this this one this works for me i think yeah this is fine after that i would like to do a little color correction for this particular person so let me just decrease uh, let me just you know layered mask for this so it will affect only this layer so let me just decrease the brightness and a little contrast what else we can do we can create one extra layer say soft light and fill the soft natural light 100% 50% gray sorry not 100% 50% gray hit ok also do the layer masking for this so it will affect only this layer I can take my dodge tool and create some artificial light for this particular layer so wait I will 
just increase the exposure I am just defining the light for this particular layer so, this is not the needed step this is just to you know give you the better look and I will do the burning on the some other side of this layer so it will give the depth see the difference I completely drawn the light for this particular person from this section that you know white light is coming in this area will be a little dark after that what one second can just group this particular layer so I can move it all together okay what else we can do is this is your person layer this is all your snow related layer what I will do is I will go to the my stock images I have already created my snow layer which I will bring to this move down from the person and I will scale it as per my choice after that what I will do that that I will just go to the screen okay something like this this whole image look a little brighter to me so what I will do is I will add one more additional layer for my brightness for overall scene except the person decrease my brightness and the contrast both something like this okay then what another thing I will do the snow is all around but there is no hint of snow in this particular you know person it goes well with the image but if I will add some snow on his shoulder and his cap it will look more real so how we'll do that we'll go to the person create the additional layer we'll write it snowflakes then we'll go to the brush I have created a snow brush so what I will do is I will add those snowflakes on the shoulder and the head part of this person so we'll, I will go with very small brush I don't know if you can see in, if you are in HD you can see it it started coming on his shoulder okay something like this sorry uh, I will like to redo this because the opacity is just 44% let me just quickly select everything and delete it from this particular layer we will increase the opacity to the 100 brush size is 45 and we will click painting it so as you can see that it start appearing the snow you know snowflakes on the shoulder we'll do something similar like this and in this area we'll add some on his cap as well
to show a little bigger snowflakes i have just increased the brush size something like this will work after that what we'll do that we'll just do the layer mask with this person so the whatever i have applied outside of this will not visible so this will be visible only for this person not the outside sort of this so this is almost we reach at the final stage after that i only think i would like to do some touch up for this If you like this video be a little more generous and hit the subscribe button and not just the subscribe button click on that small bell icon so you don't miss anything I will see you in my next episode until then stay tuned and keep supporting thanks for watching